when gases, liquids, and solids heat up. Gas. Remember that the particles in a gas are not bonded, attached to other particles. Each particle moves freely through space. When a sample of air heats up, the particles move faster and hit each other harder. The result is that the particles push each other farther apart. So when a container of gas has a balloon across the top, the balloon expands when the gas gets warm because the heated gas requires more space. Liquid. Particles in liquids are in close contact with one another. Attractions between the particles keep them from flying freely through space. The particles in liquids can still move over, around, and past one another. Individual particles in liquids can move all through the sample of liquid. The motion of particles in a liquid is kinetic energy. When a liquid gets warm, the particles move faster. The particles have more kinetic energy. As a result, they hit other particles more often and hit harder. This pushes the particles farther apart. When particles are pushed farther apart, the liquid expands. Solid. Particles in solids have bonds holding them tightly together. The particles cannot move around each other, but they can move a little. Particles in solids are always vibrating, moving rapidly back and forth in place. The vibrating motion of particles in solids is kinetic energy. Heating particles in a solid makes them vibrate faster, giving them more kinetic energy. Faster vibrating particles bump into one another more often and hit each other harder. This pushes the particles farther apart and the solid expands. The particles in liquids are held close to each other. Particles bump and slide around and past each other. When liquids get hot, the particles bump and push each other more. This causes the liquid to expand. Heating a liquid. The particles in solids are bonded. Particles move by vibrating, but they do not change positions. When solids get hot, the particles vibrate more. Increased vibration pushes the particles farther apart, causing the solid to expand. Heating a solid. Heating and cooling. When a sample of solid, liquid, or gas matter heats up, its particles gain kinetic energy. The increased kinetic energy pushes the particles farther apart. This causes the matter to expand. When a sample of solid, liquid, or gas matter cools down, its particles lose kinetic energy. The decreased kinetic energy lets the particles come closer together. This causes the matter to contract. 